Okay, so we are going to try and take on the quest, the dungeon, and the boss that is in the Etcher's mining facility. A visit to the Etcher's mining facility might be just what I need to fix my FTL drive. The distress signal and coordinates have been copied to Sal's mission tab. I need to equip the nano suit I was given through the tech menu to survive the atmosphere at the facility. I think I've done that. And before I haven't. Oh, look at that. Oh, no, I have. Herp skirt. Okay. So, we are gonna... Let's talk to Sal. The human one... The human robot. It's a little bit boring. But hi. It's a human, it's fine. And yeah, we're on my Rebecca character, which is one that I usually play whenever I'm feeling like it. She's not really progressed that much compared to other characters I have, but hey. It's okay. It allows me to show you guys some of the bosses with the limited gear that I have. So we currently have the gear that is with uh, da -da -da -da, the scavenger's helmet, scavenger's breastplate, scavenger's pants. And we also have the daggers. I'm a dagger person. We also have our compound bow, so that's good. We also have some bandages. We have some meat. We should be okay, though. Should. Let's go. Right. Here we are. Things are happening. Let's do this. There's alarms. There's lots of things. There's a mic squeaking, apparently. God dang it. We are just gonna go and try and get this boss. And try and gather as much things in here as possible. Especially, hopefully we can find some escape ropes. They will come in handy. They are definitely gonna come in handy with this quest. As I found out before. And as you will see soon enough. Hopefully, the same thing doesn't happen to me as it has in the past. So let's hope and pray. Kill them. Lovely pixels. I do believe I need to turn it down slightly as well. Hold on. Boop, 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 boop. Totally professional. I'm aware. Gad. Right, we're fine. Oh, let's put the music on. I haven't actually got music on. There we go. That's what I was missing. I was like, I'm missing something. That's what I'm missing. The epic music. Boop. Right. Loot everything. Because we might find what we need in the holes. Watch out. The gun, I don't really need it. Hear yourself. Might be fine. Just be careful. Hear yourself. Mini hatch blueprint. I'll take it. Some iron escape rope. Well, that's what I'm needing in my life right now. I'm getting lag there, actually. Huh. Cool. Boop. Right. As I we're gonna loot everything as much as we can. As much as we can, loot everything. I'm curious. See, we just get meat from that if we do it that way. That's just fine. Heal yourself. There's a man! There's a guy helping us! What are you gonna say? Why would you come to this place? Go before it's too late! No. I'm a woman on a mission. I'm here to kill your beastie. Mining blueprint. Silver pickaxe. I will take it. And let me go down. Ignore him. The guy up there will get him. Heal. And go, go, go. Heal. Go quickly before he notices me. Right, you should be fine. Kill him. Shouldn't need to go down there. Kill him. I'm not gathering the special items in here either. Either I'm not too fussed. Because you can collect a four-piece spacesuit in this area. I'm not too fussed about it, honestly. I'm really not fussed. Especially for this character. Kill. 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 I love the sound that they make when they die, just saying. I like it. It's cool. Ooh. Moon chair, which I already have, apparently. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Right, heal before we go up. Heal. 
Here. Eat some food. That should do. And I want to go over here. Another escape rope. Thank you very much, game. And I'm gonna go this way. Oh. And this way. Boop. Oh, let's help the guys in here. Because there's also loot. Just need to watch out. Because otherwise we may die. You should be okay, though. Should. Him <laughs> being the optimal word here. I know these glowing crystals weren't safe. I know that too, sir. It's okay. We're fine. We'll be okay, I promise. I might as well. I didn't even mean... I didn't even mean that. But it's okay. We already have that one, I'm pretty sure. And... That one. And we don't have that. That's a lunar base crate. A high res. Nice. Getting decent things. The more... No, oh, we need to learn that. Here we go. The more escape ropes we get right now, the better, honestly. The more escape ropes we get, the better. Because I'll just save our ass later on. For a particular thing that's about to happen. Soon. Soon, TM. Always about the soon, TM. Nah, you didn't touch me. Oh wow, I missed. Ha! Ah, missed me as well. Ta-da! I don't like the fact that I'm running out of bandages. It shouldn't be a big deal though. We'll be okay. How many of us are left? Ta-da! Right. More things. Good. Very good. I don't have that one. I know I have that though. Nice. Another escape rope. Good. And we already have that. So heal. Right. We need to be very careful. We need to get our escape rope ready. Because... That guy's a dick. And I'm doing it this way. Because he hits like a truck. Especially with his armor. Especially with this armor, actually. There'll be another one coming up soon. So, the more, as I said, the more escape ropes we have right now, the better. The more escape ropes we have, the better. So hopefully we can one-shot this guy. I'm, 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 I'm pretty confident. I'm pretty confident that we will. But then I'm gonna have no idea. Pfft, I have no idea what's gonna happen. Because, hey, who knows, RNG may not be on my side today. I have an eerie sense that something is watching us. Yeah, something is always watching you. Because you're in a video game! Hey, that's funny. My god. Right. Du -du 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 -du. Okay, there he is, right there. Right there. There he is. Move back a little bit. Up a little bit. Up a tiny little bit. Up a little bit more. Up a little bit more. God damn it. I thought I could get him from. Okay. Just run, kite him back, kite him all the way back. He's really fast, as you can see. Ta-da! Right, we're good. And we can kill him. At least we can kill him. That's a good thing. This is our main concern right now. And then, we shall soon be at... The mother load of bosses. The Etrus Crystal. The Etrus Horror. And all her glory, pink and good goodness. I was about to say gooeyness. It's, she's not really gooey, she's kind of chrysalisk. It's fine. I can deal with that. Can I do this without actually... Nope, I cannot. Well, shit. Sleep in there to regain my health. And boop, done. Okay. Now, this is where I need my bandages. Because we're about to... F right, go this way. Good RNG! Right off the bat, good RNG. So basically what you have to do for this boss is you need to avoid the lasers, shoot all, get all the levers, use all the levers, and then shoot her. And you have to do this as any good boss fight three times. Or you know, you can do it like me and just jump right into the freaking lasers. 
they should disappear in a sec. Oh, nope. Twice around. The lasers do hurt. Now, this is the one that may potentially hurt us. Down, down, down. Wait for it. Wait for it. Go, 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 go. Up. Up. Down. And I'm not being, I'm not being, I'm not being thingy. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna be patient. I can do this. Or I can't because I'm really bad at aiming. Shoot him. And we are done. That thing captured me. I'd be a mutant by now if you didn't destroy it. Good job. And we did it. It's really not that hard, as long as you know the pattern of the lasers. It's really not that hard. It really isn't that hard, so... And we have the Etcher's Horror. And 20 iron bars. And we can go over here and hand in the quest! Uh, I finally got the crystals I need to fix my ship's FTL drive. I should talk to Sal. And she gives you the 20 Etcher's crystals. Which are located right here. Or wherever in your bag. A crystal used to build FTL technology. We still don't fully understand it. Once we get back up to our ship... This is the, indeed the first boss that you do in Starbound. And once we get here, you can repeat it if you want. Don't see why you would, but hey. It is what it is. And you can now repair with the power of BUNNY! You can repair the FTL drive. It's working! I can finally visit other star systems. And then you then need to go to a moon to pick up Lichur's Liquid Etrus. Which I'm really bad at pronouncing, by the way. Just an FYI. So so then you just need to go to the moon and pick up your fuel to be able to star travel, planet travel, all the things. And you can also then enable your paint tool, which you can paint all the things with, which is lovely. But the Etrus Horror, which we picked up, tells us about that lovely guy. The Etrus Horror. We are calling it the Etrus Horror in spite of a true name for it. When the facility was locked down, we were trapped down here with it. And believe me, horror is a perfect description for this creature. We found it in a deep vein of Etrus crystal, and upon uncovering the thing, it awoke. At first we thought it was a sentient crystal, but a desperate attack with a mining laser cannon uncovered a single, unblinking eye within. It fires streams of searing plasma at us, destroying most of our equipment. Attacking up close was impossible. Those who got too close were drawn inside it, transformed into mutant servants for the monster. We fled, and the mutants followed. The laser cannon was left intact, however. Perhaps a braver soul than I could go back and use it to destroy the creature. They would have to be agile enough to dodge its beams and strong enough to defeat its corrupted lackeys. A disturbing thought occurs. This thing could be a parasite. But who is to say creatures like this aren't instead the source of the crystals? We may never know for sure, but I hope for everyone's sake that this plague doesn't leave this doomed moon. And there you go. That is all of the first boss content. Hypo!